This is Mama Risa and I'm your math buddy in the world of mathematics. In this video lesson, we are going to learn about division. Learners, do you like to hear a story? My story is about Santa Claus. Santa Claus is the man who gives gifts during Christmas. He lives in a beautiful city called Santa Claus Village. Every day, he works hard in wrapping gifts for children. Santa Claus is very generous. He loves to share. He looks for good children all over the ville. He always makes sure to have bundles of gift toys and candies for the good little boys and girls. One day, when Santa Claus was walking around the ville, he saw three children. But he had nine candies left in his bag. What do you think is the operation to be used in the given problem? Very good! We will use division. Division is a method of distributing a group of things into equal parts. It is one of the four basic operations of arithmetic which gives a fair result of sharing. Santa Claus gave one candy to each child, six candies left with him. He gave one more candy to each of them, so there were only three candies left with Santa. He again gave one candy to each child. Now, zero candies are left with him. There are nine candies and three groups in all. Therefore, they have three candies each. Nine divided by three equals to three. Santa Claus was very happy to see the smile on the face of the three children. Division is represented by this sign. Dividend is a number that being divided. A divisor is a number that divides the dividend. And the answer in division is called quotient. Anna has five friends. He had 15 balloons. She wants to share them equally with her friends. How many balloons each friend would get? Thus, we can say that 15 balloons have been shared equally among 5 friends by giving 3 balloons to each one of them. This means 15 divided by 5 is equal to 3. Here is another example. Mother has 12 apples. She has to give apples to four children, so let's help her share the apples equally. Now, we have shared the apples equally, so each child gets three apples. Always remember that we can use division to find how many groups there are or how many are in each group. Now, let's try to study the given facts in each number, then find the quotient. 20 ball pens, 2 ball pens in each box. How many boxes are there? Eight chocolate bars, two chocolate bars each child. How many children have chocolate bars? Ten balloons, two balloons in each table. 
how many tables have balloons? Six balls, two balls each child. How many children have balls? Fourteen flowers. Each flower vase has two flowers. How many flower vases are there? And that's all for today. Once again, this is Mama Marisa and see you again on our next episode. Bye!